So, rumor has it that Chris Hemsworth is not too keen with being replaced as the MCU's Thor. Let's see what we have to see here. It says the culmination of the Infinity Saga seemed to make a pretty make it pretty, pretty clear that the Marvel Universe were reshuffling their deck in a major way, with the characters that had led the MCU since Phase One slowly being replaced by a new batch of superheroes. Iron Man, Black Widow, Captain America are already out of the picture. Disney Plus's Hawkeye will see Clint Barton take a backseat to Kate Bishop. And the Hulk is legally barred from starring in solo movies, which leaves Chris Hemsworth Thor as the last original Avenger with a majority part to play. Wow, I never even thought about that. That being said, with the Love and Thunder set to establish Jane Foster as the new God of Thunder, there's already been speculation that Hemsworth's days could be numbered, and we've now heard that the actor isn't particularly happy about it. According to our intel, which comes from the same source who told us Guardians of the Galaxy will be making a cameo in Love and Thunder, the national and that National Treasure 3 and now You See Me 3 are in development, all of which turned out to be correct. The Australian actor doesn't want to be forced out of the spotlight when Thor is at his most popular following his acclaimed reinvention in Ragnarok. Hey, I understand that. I understand that. I can get that. Uh, similar to reports of Chadwick Boseman taking issues with Marvel's plans to eventually phase in Shuri to become the Black Panther, Hemsworth feels that they've barely scratched the surface of the new version of Thor, and he's said to be pretty disappointed that he's being shunted into the background of his own franchise. Oh, God. The Extraction star has admitted that the first two Thor movies weren't up to scratch, and ever since... Uh, Taika Waititi first got his hands on the Odin son. The character has turned out to be one of MCU's major highlights. That's the damn truth. And as the elder statesman of the long-running series, if Hemsworth doesn't plan on walking away from his career defining role in the near future, then there's still plenty of ways to give him a major part, even if he's no longer Asgard's protector. Which is true. I absolutely do not want to see him gone. He's hilarious and he is badass all at the same time. I love him. I love him. I really do. I never thought that um, him going the comedic route would work, but it absolutely did. I was absolutely wrong. I was worried about it when I was in the Soul of Ragnarok, but I was so happy when I was done. I bought my 3D copy, and I do watch it every once in a while. I love it. I love it, man. It worked. I was laughing my behind off, but he still kept his badassery. I loved it, man. Um, <laughs> Disney, please do not do this to this man. Let us see more of, of, of Odin's son. Please. I don't care if Jane Foster you know, gets to play him for a little bit, but you got to keep him as a major factor. I really don't care, but you got to keep him as a major factor, okay? Post comments down below. Let me know what you all think, and if you enjoyed my video, hit the like button, subscribe, and share.